Now let's check in with 10 Tampa Bay's reporter, Aduri Achumba, who is live in Sarasota. Yeah, Aduri, last time we checked in with you, it looked like the weather was improving. How's it doing now? It's, uh, it's, it's, it's still windy out here, and we just saw about half an hour ago the owner of that cat trimaran, I'm told, that, was, uh, that had crashed into the Tony Sofrito Pier here. He uh, was able to tow it away uh, using his speedboat. I'm told he's taking it over to the 10th, boat, uh, 10th Street boat ramp. Uh, they did leave some parts of that trimaran here. And as you can see, a railing has broken off, a pretty significant damage uh, that was sustained to the pier here. Uh, an eyewitness uh, that I spoke to told me that the vessel had broken off from a mooring at the Sarasota Squadron and that it floated over here and hit the ramp uh, and hit the pier and was bobbing on here for several hours until they were able to get to it and try to tether it to the railing here. Now the pier uh, not long ago underwent a $1.4 million upgrade and reopened in April of last year. Now the reason for those repairs was because of the frequent crashing of boats into the pier and uh, the owner, I'm told, uh, was able to get a was able to secure the mast as well uh, as some rigging on the boats before they were able to tow it away. Again, I'm told that he's taking it over to the 10th Street boat ramp. Uh, we're going to find out what kind of damage it sustained. But as you can see with the piece here, some pretty significant damage to that boat. Live in Sarasota, Doria Chumba, 10 Tampa Bay.